All right, guys. So who wants to be smarter? Who wants to be more efficient in their day-to-day -day cognitive function? Who wants to be able to have faster processing speeds, faster reaction times? Do students want to be faster at what they learn? Or would they like to, in fact, retain a lot more? Would uh, engineers like to compute things faster? Uh, would pilots want to process different functional parameters and tasks far faster and more efficiently? Well, of course. The fantastic news here is that you can actually now accomplish this in terms of actual brain stimulation and enhancement. Using advances in technology, there have now been published research that I can briefly share with you regarding how we can actually make a young, healthy, otherwise normal person far smarter with faster processing speeds. So there have been a number of studies, numerous, in the last several decades, especially in the last five to six years, that show that by stimulating the prefrontal cortex, the very front of the region involved in executive function, you can actually help increase processing speed. There have been physiological measures of this, meaning that uh, there are physiological measures of the cortical response time we actually see faster processing speeds and reaction times. And it's not just physiological markers. Patients perform better and faster under cognitive tests, digital cognitive tests, and day-to-day -day functioning. So stimulating the brain using electromagnetic pulses, specifically using uh, repetitive transparent magnetic stimulation, has in fact shown to make someone who's already, you know, within normal limits with no particular disorder, actually retain memory better, that's episodic memory, have faster reaction. Theoretically, there may be some side effects such as headaches, neck pain, even seizures. But by and large, the seizure risks are very, very small. The vast majority of patients, probably greater than 90%, I would say more than 95 to 99%, have very little to any side effects. So here we are talking about an actual external stimulation of selected regions of the brain, preferably under MRI navigation, that can actually change or significantly improve someone's processing speed. In addition to, of course, the natural day-to-day -day things that you're doing, that you should be doing with respect to drinking lots of fluids, making sure you're well hydrated, exercise. Now, you're just sitting there on a chair, maybe even watching TV, and we're applying electromagnetic stimulation to selected regions of the brain without any risk. And after the stimulation, you perform better. So this is fantastic and a huge development that we'll see it more and more of. Thank you.